Hey guys, in this video, I show you how to uninstall and delete the IS15 public beta and then uh, go back to IS14.7 step by step. So let's get started. Hey guys, from my phone, from Tech, and back to the new video. So in this video, I show you how to uninstall and delete the IS15 public beta step by step and then go back to IS14.7. So there's a if he reason he can do this because if you don't know as 15 is still on beta it will go with the public to everyone probably in the September October ish so right there so so that's why it's still on beta so there, there is still some uh, a bugs and stuff and it's still it will do some crashing and stuff so that's why if you want you can go back to as 14.7 so this is how you do it so if I just go to my setting in general soft update as you can see I'm actually running the as 15 the uh, first step to uh, delete and install this is to tap on the VPN and DOS management, tap on the profile, tap on the remove, then tap on uh, remove. After that, just click on restart. So, after you tap restart, uh, uh, then you're gonna see your phone gonna go black and then it, it will show the Apple logo and now your phone will uh, turn on. So, uh, that is happening now. You're gonna put, just put your phone to the side and now you're gonna uh, head to your computer. So you can use any computer you want, you can use Mac or Windows. First thing you do is you can open up any browser you want and then just open up a new tab. And then you're gonna type in this right here, ipsw.me. So just pause the video and then type this in right here. So, so after you type this in, uh, now you're gonna go to iPhone or I iPad. If you are using the iPad OS 15, just tap right there. So just tap on, the f tap on iPhone and then choose what iPhone you have. So for me, it's the iPhone 7 Plus. So just tap on that, just tap on it, and, and now just give it a few seconds until this thing to load. And now you're gonna see something like this. So this is the important part, as you can see right here. So there's a two version you can get, as 14.7 and as 14.6. If you don't know all of this, are is unsigned. So that means if you try to install any of this, you can tap on and download it, but things and none of them will work. So if you are trying to install using iTunes, so that's what we're gonna use later in the video. And none of this will work, like none of them. So make sure you see a check. So like after after I upload this video, if you see this after a month, and if you see 14.8, then just get that because that is the one will be assigned if there's a 14.8. So now just you just gonna tap on it, and then you just gonna tap on this download right here. Click on download. And now you're gonna see something like this. So now you're just gonna click on save, and in the bottom, in the bottom hand corner, you're gonna see it is gonna start downloading right here. So I already have this, so I'm gonna cancel it. But for for you guys, make sure you download it. After that, you're gonna get something called iTunes. If you don't have it, just open up the uh, a Microsoft Store. I'll show you guys. Just open up the Microsoft Store right here, and then in the in the top, just in the top right here just uh, type in iTunes right here just click on it and then click on download after that uh, now is the important part is to p p plug in your device so after you plug it in you just see your iPhone logo right, right here so uh, be be before you tap on that there's a one important thing you need to do you need to go on your phone you need to go in the uh, recovery mode so to d uh, do that just the first thing you need to do is you're going to turn off your device right here so after turn off your device so now i need to enter to the recovery mode for that you need to hold up volume down button and then the power button at the same time until you see the uh, uh, itunes logo so just keep holding it boom and now she see something like this right here so it will say support.apple.com uh, slash iphone slash restore so make sure you see this right here now as you can see here so you're just gonna click on cancel and now this is the important part you need to hold down the shift and and then you need to click on the a uh, restore mode so just hold down the shift and click on restore and now this is why you're gonna pick your psw file so the uh, file you're gonna restore in the version and then you're gonna click open and after that it will extract that file it, it will extract the update and then it will do all the wo 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 work for you but thing is with this you're gonna lose everything uh, for from your phone but thing is if you, do, uh, you don't want to lose anything uh, for from your phone if you want to keep all the data uh, then uh, you don't forget to click on the uh, this video right now so 
uh, that is how you g that is how you uninstall and then uh, delete the as 15 public by the step by step and also using this you can just, uh, uh, recover your data uh, uh, by just watching uh, the, that video so see you on the next video then peace out